and Skeet coming down. Oh. Big slide. So close. And that I was awesome. He, he had to tighten his hands so he didn't get into the side of Olivier Moretta and nearly lost control of the Audi. Now he looks to the inside. Look at this side by side coming off that final corner. And away we go. Skeet able to get that pass done. Well, you know, I was always kind of a card guy. My dad was a car guy and uh, he was doing a lot of kart racing. So I followed him to the track every weekend. and. Started doing that and went up through NASA and club racing into Trans Am and on to World Challenge. There is a look at Skeen. And remember, folks, he started dead last in round one, worked his way up to 16th. Still not much for points, but on the way, got a lap good for eighth and has been nothing short of brilliant here today, bringing that car up into the third spot that to build this Hawk Performance CRP machine. Uh, he is just something very special and it's great to see him getting uh, the opportunity up against these great international drivers to show what he can do. Well, I love all kinds of motorsports. You know, the last couple of years with Hawk Performance, I've gotten to do uh, the Baja 1000 a couple of times. Uh, we went to Pike Speak last year and won our class, Pike Speak Open. So, uh, yeah, a lot of cool stuff. Done some NASCAR road races and uh, just love all of it. Ski looking her way around DL, side by side. Oh, look at this. Oh, under the curb. Ski touches it, but gave each other enough room. Skeen through Dial. Awesome move there by Mike Skeen, and Dial recognized he couldn't find it, had to give it up. Yeah, fantastic. I'll tell you what a great story Mike Skeen has been over the last few years. Oh, uh, the Audi's a great car. You know, it, it's an older platform for the GT3 spec cars, but uh, we have a lot of them here. They're fun cars to drive. They're really quick uh, under brakes and in the corners, especially. Uh, but yeah, it's a really fun car to drive, very easy and forgiving, so we really enjoy it. This is the interesting battle here. This is Mike Skeen in fifth, and Johnny O, Johnny Red in that Cadillac coming after that to build his Audi. Funny thing there, that's two redheads. Mike Skeen also as <laughs> well. So battle the redheads here with Mike Skeen and Johnny O'Connell. Well, this year, obviously, the, the car count is up really high. The you know level of teams are, is excellent. Uh, we have awesome cars all throughout the field. So you know the fans really love it. They've got all kinds of exotic cars out here, and it's just a great spectacle. And Skeen in attack mode right now. Let's see if everything settles just a little bit. Dyson all over the back of Skeen. Yeah, Devilvis is uh, part of the Carlisle group, which we've been working with for several years. Hawk was also a part of that. And we just decided that this year would be a good fit to get Devilvis a, a little bit more coverage. Well, obviously coming off of last year near the championship uh, you know, contention, it was a little bit heartbreaking to come away second place right in the finale, but hopefully, you know, we can stay in contention throughout uh, throughout the year in the points. Skeen down the inside of Eversley. Oh, Skeen, that was beautiful. Got there and just used that little bit of arrow advantage that the GT3 cars have. Well, obviously, uh, CRP Racing and Devilvis, uh, Hawk Performance, we have a lot of great sponsors that help us put this together. Uh, we just brought on Jet Hot Coatings this weekend, and uh, very excited about it.